What's that? Go. Stay back! When you look at a corgi, you look at a dog that you really want to cheer for. I think you see this little potato with these little stubby legs. And, you know, for us, being able to make them sort of larger than life in their own videos, it's sort of like the justice that they deserve in some strange way. So I think everyone enjoys a comeback story. And I think they probably don't mind that it's through, you know, Hammy and Olivia's two talking corgis. Don't stop! Oh, right! My two pets are Hammy, who is a four-year-old Pembroke Welsh Corgi, and Olivia, who is a six-year-old Pembroke Welsh Corgi. I was dating my fiance, Sarah, for about a year, and it was her dream to always have a Corgi. Olivia came into our life as, you know, the third member of our family just about six years ago. About two years later, we just really wanted to get Olivia a friend and someone that she could grow up with. So the moment we decided that we wanted to start creating videos was in March of 2020, right when the coronavirus pandemic started to hit and I stopped traveling for work. We had a lot of extra time and I needed a creative outlet to be able to do something in our home. I just started talking with Olivia and Hammy and filming it. He's so fat. Be nice, Olivia. We put it on TikTok and it was absolutely amazing to us just to see how widely accepted it was from the TikTok community. You want the list? The response was absolutely tremendous. We were getting all sorts of direct messages from sick people in hospitals, terminally ill children that say that like they just needed to have their daily laugh of these two corgis. <laughs> We got a call from a 911 operator actually to let us know that she actually sends people that call for suicides um, to our channel just to get a good laugh and to forget about whatever they might be experiencing anxiety from. What's the bread doing out? God, it's me! Oh! In order for them to perform, you know, we've had to over time train them on just doing certain tasks. When we've shot 400 videos, just getting them to sit, stay, stay, getting them to go from point A to point B to hop up on something like those go a long way when you're creating content. So we actually carve out an hour of every day just for what we call you know personal development with them. They're very treat motivated. So it doesn't hurt that they also associate that with treat time and being able to get a good snack. Does it look good enough to eat? I think that after doing this for 15 months, my two dogs and I have gotten tremendously close. We spend now 24 hours a day, seven days a week together. We wake up loving to do this. They wake up from their morning naps and they know that once we walk into Olivia's closet, it's time to put on an outfit and they associate filming with getting treats. I want the world to know that Hammy and Olivia love doing this. And we absolutely love doing this as a family. It's something that we go to bed thinking about. It's something that we wake up thinking about. And we put our heart and soul into every video that we do. And it's really just to make sure that you can just smile for 15 seconds at a time. And if we can be that escape, that's something that's going to fill our hearts.